one is February 3rd, 2023 and the time right now in Calgary is 7.40 p.m. and the temperature is pretty good, positive 4 degrees Celsius and in this video I'm going to show you guys the famous winter festival in Calgary which is Chinook Blast and it starts from January 27th and it will end February 18th and in this winter festival there are so many light show uh, live performer concert is going on so let's explore the winter festival in Calgary and I just start my walk the famous uh, Stephen Avenue because most of the uh, Chinook Blast <coughs> light festival and perf light performer they are gonna perform in the um, Stephen Avenue and Olympic Plaza yeah you already know there is so much music so I'm not sure <laughs> is it copyright or no if it's not then I will continue my sound otherwise I have to mute the sound which I don't like it at all <laughs> Because I want to uh, like uh, show you guys the, all the natural thing and what is going on right now. We include the music as well. So this winter festival is every year is uh, going on in Calgary. So most of the time last year it was minus. I think minus 30 degrees Celsius when the Chinook blast is going on but this year this weekend is pretty good we are so lucky but it's very slushy because it's positive weather yes you know that uh, like last week there is a huge snowfall in Calgary and all the snow is just melting so you can hear all the sound noise already so there is some light performer is performing right now and so it's already you can see how fast it is <laughs> and also the fire pit is here Oh, 
what is it? Bye. Oops. I'm not sure what is this, what they make.
Ocha or is blue today. There is another performer who is performing. right now I need to wear my gloves so also I am I want to let you know guys I'm going to Quebec province to enjoy the biggest winter carnival in not only in Canada, not only in North America, but in also the entire world, the biggest winter carnival in Quebec. So I'm going next week to see the winter carnival and also I'm going to show you guys the Quebec City Life, Montreal, the Quebec Old Port, Quebec Ice Hotel, so many more. And I also show you guys uh, the small Quebec city life, how is it, the expense and the job opportunity as well. And if I get enough time, I, I'm going to visit Ontario and the Niagara Falls as well. I'm not sure about the Niagara Falls yet, but uh, if I visit Ontario, definitely I'm going to uh, the Niagara Falls as well. Ooh, look at oh, look at this ice. 
this. The dragon! Uh, last year also I saw that dragon also here. Mm -hmm. See the bear, I think I come. Uh, the wrong way.
So you can also enter from here as well. There is, um, I think, the indigenous uh, music festival is going on. Sad Lake Cree Nation. Um, I grew up idolizing a lot of our powwow singers and round dance singers because I remember that's probably one of the only set of cassette tapes that my dad had was a bunch of recording of powwows and round dances. And um, it was always a goal of mine, a huge role model in, um, in me starting to sing and compose my own songs was my uncle Randy Boyd. And this next song that I'm going to share with you is off of my album I entitled Gegawino, which means all of our mother. This song is a really special song. It's called Remember Me. A little story behind this song was it was originally composed for a late uncle of mine on behalf of my uncle Randy. You know, I never expected um, for people to, to connect with it in such a special way. And it's um, one of the most special songs that I, I have out there and that I share with my uncle and I'd like to sing it for you guys. Yeah. 